I played through, what was it, 80 hours of fucking Assassin's Creed, the Greek one. And uh, by the end of it, I, I definitely was contemplating uh, suicide. <laughs> <laughs> Because I wasted, I felt like I wasted 80 hours. Uh, it's like, I don't know. And then when I was like, all right, Valhalla, like, this, you know, it's Becky got for me. It's real nice. I'm playing it. I'm like, man, this is just worse. You know, and then it, and then it, and then it just opened my eyes. <laughs> so maybe they were all shitty. <laughs> <laughs> you know what yeah that's where i sit with that stuff now it's like you know what i was young and dumb and full of cum once <laughs> 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 so i mean like i don't know a part of me still likes the idea of like doing the back in time shit and being like ah man i'm fighting dudes with swords or whatever but like i don't know i feel like there's something better Tsushima was just better in all regards. It's like, that was like, for me, like what Assassin's Creed should be by now. And they're making the same thing every fucking time they put out one of those fucking horseshit games. I don't know. It's like, Tsushima was great. And it was like everything I've wanted from like an Assassin's Creed style game where it's like, the story was well done. The voice acting was great. It wasn't like fucking, fucking 30 of the same side character that I'm like, Oh, his voice sounds exactly like this other guy. <laughs> yeah. And they all sounded like they, they fucking were held at gunpoint to do voice lines or something. Like, oh my god. And yeah, it had a little bit of checkbox stuff in Tsushima too, but I just liked being in that world a lot better than uh, the last two Assassin's Creed games especially, because uh, they were pretty... At least with Egypt, I was like, oh, man, it's fucking, you know, it's Cairo and shit. Like, cool. It's the pyramids of Giza. But it's like, in uh, the Greek one, it was like, oh, well, oh, there's the Pass of Thermopylae. You actually can't go there in the game. Whatever. Okay. <laughs> there's, you know, the uh, the Parthenon, right, in Athens. And that's like it. I, I don't know, man. It's just kind of like everything else is forgettable. Uh, it's way too big of a game. Um, I think it was like the biggest map to date. And then they were like, all right, Valhalla, we're making that map four times the size of uh, the Odyssey map. And that's what it was, Odyssey. Odyssey. That's what it was. The Greek one was Odyssey. I just want to let everyone know, Pythagoras apparently uh lived forever <laughs> he was immortal spoiler yeah dude it's not even funny no <laughs> no uh yeah uh it was it was really stupid uh the main chick at the end of the game gives this staff that makes you live forever she just gives it to somebody she's like oh yeah i've lived for like three thousand years so i like me i was like because she had, like, a suit on and shit, you know? She's, like, so she'd been living for 3,000 years. And I'm like, does she just carry the staff everywhere she goes? How did she get there? Did she fly from somewhere else? And, like, she's like, oh, man, I got this staff I got to bring. Like, did they let her get on the plane with the staff? <laughs> like, <laughs> what if she has to go to sleep? What does she do then? Because as soon as <laughs> Pythagoras gave the staff to her, he turned into dust. <laughs> it was so stupid. <laughs> oh, man. And that was the fucking thing at the end of the game. It was like, oh, this is Atlantis. And that was it. And I was like, oh, I guess the game's over? I don't know. Like, And then it was the credits. I'm like, well, what the fuck? What does that mean? <laughs> <laughs> None of the shit that happened in like the real world mattered. You know? There was like, ah, oh, man, we gotta find this other artifact. They've been looking for artifacts for like the past like five games, I guess. Like, Jesus Christ, man. At least in Origins, I like the main character. I don't know. He was a daddy. He was a daddy. Oh. Uh, daddy but yeah, time. I don't know. 
But I don't know, maybe they're all shitty, and I'm just fucking... Just fucking stupid. Um, I think I if I go back and play them all now... That, they, that they're all bad. They were never good. <laughs> I think that is a distinct possibility, yes. <sighs> God. Black Flag was cool. <laughs> I liked being a pirate. Now they have Skull and Bones. Oh, dude, when are we going to play Skull and Bones and go... Uh, oh, dude, I'm, uh, I'm going to be playing it day one uh, on uh, Ooh Play nice. Plus. Ooh Play Plus. Did anyone else listen to that fucking clip? The guy just being like, all right, ship health. Uh, <laughs> sales. Nice. <laughs> That's the game director. Yeah. He's like falling asleep playing his own game for other people to watch. <laughs> yeah. The community manager, like I said, it was like it was like they brought Becca in to like play. And he's like, Oh, so where do I go? What am I doing? <laughs> Who am I? What am I doing? <laughs> <laughs> oh man. <laughs> 